In your walk through life with Jesus, have you ever been tempted to give up on him, to, to turn back from that relationship, go your own way? If so, you wouldn't be the first one to think about snatching defeat from the jaws of victory. Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond and welcome again to Fresh. In my younger years, I played a few seasons of a brand of football called rugby. It was not my finest hour. The cardinal sin is dropping the ball. Your teammates just glare at you in utter disbelief. <laughs> I remember it well. So many people who believe in Jesus end up dropping the ball. You're running along, a brutal tackle knocks you to the ground, and when you have the wind knocked out of you, the great temptation is to drop the ball. But if you believe in Jesus, you have an eternity waiting for you that's beyond comprehension, an inheritance that's imperishable, undefiled and unfading, being kept in heaven for you. 1 Peter chapter 1, verses 3 to 6. Praise be to God and the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. God has great mercy, and because of his mercy, he gave us a new life. This new life brings us a living hope through Jesus Christ's resurrection from the death. Now we wait to receive the blessings God has for his children. These blessings are being kept for you in heaven. They cannot be ruined or destroyed or lose their beauty. God's power protects you through your faith and it keeps you safe until your salvation comes. That salvation is ready to be given to you at the end of time. I know the thought of that is exciting, even if you must suffer through different kinds of troubles for a short time. So whatever you do, no matter how hard it gets, no matter how brutal the tackle, don't drop the ball. That's God's word, fresh for you today. Look, I don't know about you, but I need encouragement to stay on course. I need teaching from the Word of God to keep my life focused on honouring God and staying the course. So if you'd like to go a bit deeper, then let me encourage you to stop by at ChristianityWorks.com and right there on the homepage, you'll see This Week on TV. You can watch this week's half hour television program for some more in-depth teaching from God's Word. Again, that web address is ChristianityWorks.com.